Defending champions Mount Pleasant tasted defeat for the first time this season when they were beaten 2-1 by Caribbean Cup finalist Cavalier on match day 9 in the Red Navy Jamaica Premier League in the feature Monday night game at Sabina Park. The only unbeaten team left in the competition coming into this round, the St. Anne team surrendered the lead to 10-man Cavalier who marched to their third win of the season. Romeo Guthrie fired Mount Pleasant into the lead in the 50th minute and Cavalier responded with strikes from Chanel Thomas and Jalmaro Calvin. Cavalier enjoyed the better of the exchanges in the first half while getting few chances. Chanel Thomas was presented with the best scoring opportunity but goalkeeper Shaquan Davis was excellent for Mount Pleasant as the teams were locked in a goalless affair at the halftime break. On the resumption, the champions early in the second half broke the deadlock through a wonderful strike from Guthrie. Second half action here. At Savannah Park. Nil on the scoreline. Cavalier and Mount Pleasant, the top two teams from last season. They battle it out here at Savannah Park to decide the title. The Mount Pleasant came out on top. And they are defending their title now. All played outside. Goal kick won by the Mount Pleasant team. Mount Pleasant having the better of the exchanges in the first half. But at the halfway mark, it was nil on between both teams. Here is Mount Pleasant on the attack once again. Ball cleared of field by the Cavalier defenders. Amaro Phillips goes to the turf, whistle on the play. Kick to Mount Pleasant. We are into the second half of this encounter here at Savannah Park. Mount Pleasant against Cavalier, nil on the scoreline. Here is Damari Phillips with a kick now for Mount Pleasant. Mount Pleasant continuing to lead the standings here in the Premier League. The only unbeaten team left in the competition. Here is Damari Phillips now with the kick. Arms are Kimbo. Still has to wait some more. Referee taking care of some matters in this in the penalty area. There's a player down. He's back on his feet. Conversation there between the Mount Pleasant captain Suley McCullough, the referee, and the, some of the Cavalier players. But it looks like we're ready now for that kick. Here is the Mario Phillips. Kicks it headed out by the defense for Cavalier. And it goes into touch for a, not a throw to Mount Pleasant. Ball back into touch on the far side. Another throw. This time to Cavalier. Through is taken. Comes back to Mount Pleasant. Phillips plays it right side. Mount Pleasant coming forward now. Mount Pleasant on the attack. They are taken down. No whistle, the referee says play on. And it comes all the way back now to the goalkeeper Vino Bartlett for the Cavalier team. He rolls it right side. Comes back to the goalkeeper. Cavalier in possession. Coming forward. Whistle on the play. Free kick now won by the Cavalier team. Nil all the scoreline here at Sabina Park. The 
Cavalier player puts it into touch for another throw. Midway, the Mount Pleasant half. In fact, it's a kick. Uh, Sully McCullough gets ready to take the free kick. Here is McCullough now with the kick. Sully McCullough finds Devonte Campbell on the left side. Beats his man nicely. Goes down the line. Turns it inside. Headed into the box now. And comes to Guthrie. And Guthrie a brilliant shot. Scores. Romeo Guthrie gets his first goal for the Mount Pleasant team. And Mount Pleasant takes the lead just after the start of the second half. In fact, on 49 minutes, Romeo Guthrie brilliantly taken shot. And it's into the back of the net. Mount Pleasant takes the lead. 1-0 against Cavalier in the Jamaica Premier League encounter here at Sabina Park. Brilliant shot there by Romeo Guthrie. Disaster came for Cavalier in the 58th minute when Giovanni Leng was red carded when he received a second yellow card for a late tackle. Thomas, the leading striker for Cavalier, got the better of the Mount Pleasant defence in the 73rd minute and was brought down in the box to win a penalty which he calmly started home to level the score at 1-1. Free kick to be taken here by the Cavalier team. Headed into the box, cleared by Mount Pleasant. Goes into touch for a throw on the left side for the Cavalier team. Mount Pleasant leading this contest by one goal to nil. Here is a throw by Cavalier. They are in possession. Ball played into the box and the Shaquan Davis takes it easily. Completed some brilliant saves in the first half. Shaquan Davis. Here is Devonte Campbell now. Loses it. Jalmaro. With it for Cavalier. Here is Chanel Thomas. And it comes into the box easily held by the goalkeeper for Mount Pleasant. Cavalier down to 10 players but still battling on Giovanni Leng shown the red card picked up his second yellow card so the Cavalier team now down to 10 players here is Mount Pleasant on the far side coming forward flag goes up Ball goes into touch. Unpleasant losing possession. Comes back to the left back for Cavalier. Knocking it around in their own half. Plays it forward. Cavalier. Play broken up. And the ball goes into touch once again. Another throw to the rural speed condition team. Cavalier here at Sabina Park. Ball, play, ball played long upfield. Intercepted there by Sule Makala for Mount Pleasant. Only succeeds in getting it over the line. And so the Cavalier team wins another throw. Throw taken. Cavalier in possession. Coming forward in their own half still. And the ball is played back to the goalkeeper for Cavalier. He plays it forward. Cavalier in possession. Long ball upfield. Comes now to... Jalmaro Calvin shot towards goal well saved there by the goalkeeper from Mount Pleasant diving full stretch it was heading into the top right hand corner but Shaquan Davis pulled off another brilliant save and keeps the scoreline at 1-0 in favour of Cavalier corner taken now by the Cavalier team 
and rolls past a number of players and comes to the goalkeeper for Mount Pleasant. Chakwan Davis, he plays it, he bowls it forward, finds the Mario Phillips. Here is Phillips coming forward with it now. Stops, turns, turns it back now to his fellow defender, Topi. Here is the Cavalier team coming forward once again. Jalmaro Calvin with it, under pressure, plays it inside, trying to find Chanil. Uh, Thomas, Thomas is brought down as there's a whistle on the play. Penalty being awarded by the referee. So Chanil Thomas is brought down in the box. And the referee points to the spot. Cavalier with 10 men gets an opportunity to love the score here at Sabina Park. Brilliant play there by the Antiguan Calvin dribbling down the right side under pressure from two Mount Pleasant defenders but succeeded in getting it back towards the penalty spot and Chanel Thomas was there but he was taken down by it looks to be Nathaniel James and the referee points to the spot penalty to the Cavalier team Thomas himself is going to be taking this penalty and an opportunity now for Cavalier to equalize in this contest Mount Pleasant leading by a goal to nil and here is Chanel Thomas now with a penalty here he comes steps up shoots and gets it into the back of the net 1-1 the score line here now at Sabina Park between Cavalier and Mount Pleasant Chanel Thomas on the end of that one he was brought down in the box and he stepped up to take the penalty easily getting it past the goalkeeper Shaquan Davis was done a brilliant job here so far tonight for the Mount Pleasant team 1-1 the scoreline as we enter the final quarter of this contest they then grab the lead nine minutes later when Jalmaro Calvin glanced to Mahela from a corner that sealed the deal despite both teams going close to scoring in the last moments of the encounter Barclay plays this one out comes all the way back to the defense of Mount Pleasant they plays it forward Mount Pleasant in possession Devonte Campbell playing it back comes to the left side McCullough plays it into the center circle finds Topi Topi plays it long long diagonal pass intercepted by the Cavalier defender and it goes into touch for a throw Akala will take the throw Cavalier comes away with it Cavalier in possession on the right side and it's cleared up one time by Cummings into touch it goes for a throw to Cavalier One won the scoreline here at Sabina Park. But this is a game that is not yet over. Ten man Cavalier against Mount Pleasant. A repeat of the 2023, 2022, 2023 final. Cavalier against Mount Pleasant. Corner won by the Cavalier team. As we come towards the 81st minute of this contest. Corner kick won by Cavalier on the right side. Taking some time to take this corner kick. Cavalier. Here is a kick now taken by Irving. Comes to Calvin and he heads it into the back of the net. Jalmaro Calvin. The Antiguan. Puts Cavalier into the lead. It's 2-1. 82 minutes gone. And the Antiguan finds the back of the net. Cavalier with 10 players into the lead. Beautifully taken header. And it makes it Cavalier 2. Mount Pleasant 1. Jalmaro Calvin. Puts the Rodal Speed coach team in front. Whitmore spoke after the game. 
Well, it's um, credit must be given to the Cavalier team. Came back down from one goal, ten men, you know, to, to get a victory. So credit must be, be given. Um, on the other hand, I think um, complacency get the better of us after, you know, the Cavalier, Cavalier team went down to ten men and we were leading one nil. And if you look on the two goals, um, can see the this afternoon, it, it, it is unacceptable. But as I said before, it's a, it, it's the nature of the game. We have to move forward. I think you have to go really right like a little coach. Um, no, to set in a little after no, the start there's the there's no reason to 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 read it right. Mm -hmm. like I think um, it's just a wake up call. You know, uh, um, on the day anybody can win a football game. If if, 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 you, if you don't come here, come here to play, then that's the nature. Yeah, confident, you, you, you're definitely bounce back soon. Then, well, as I say, it's early days. You know, we, we didn't expect. We wanted to, but we didn't expect. We always um, look forward to, to, to the next game. So we just have to brush ourselves off and move on. Is it a reminder that despite the quality that you have, it reminded to the players that despite the quality that you guys are good, you guys are young, to come here and fight for every trip? Well, as I, as I said before, on any given day, if you don't turn up to play a football game, you can lose any game. So again, this is just a wake up call for us to see that, hey, we are in a competition with, with, with 13 other teams. Mount Pleasant will be back at home at Jack's Hall on Sunday against 8th place Vare United.